tell your story, who you are, you know what I mean? And you can't worry about what other people are doing because it's not the right way for you, you know? It's kind of like what I've done, bodybuilding. So always trust your instincts, believe in where you are. Never quit, never give up. The bad times will last forever. Spend time alone. Some people are afraid to spend time alone, you know? In the gym, I found peace because it was almost like a therapy for myself. I found something that nobody could take away from me. I started seeing changes that I was in control of. So the mind of the man is the most powerful thing. And I always say where the mind goes, the body will follow. Be a creator, use your mind. Think outside, you create something more powerful that's never been done before. And I think when you tap into this, then every man is successful. When he finds his own unique abilities, and gifts, special gifts, you know? Some people's gifts is music. Some people's gifts is their hands. Some people's gifts is doctor, lawyer, musician. You use these gifts, make your environment, make your moment in life better, not only for you, but for everyone else around you. So be your own unique individual in life. So the world wants to know you, who you are. So I've been able to, through all of my good times, bad times, sad times, you know, moments where I felt like giving up and quitting, I've been able to tap into, over a lifetime, who we are and we become when we don't try to be like others, and we don't try to follow others, but we learn from our environment. I think this is the most powerful thing. get there, everybody see him, they don't realize that he was serious this time. Old school. I think he in the best shape of his whole career. What we did, we went back to basics. Old school. Training hard, no playing around, no hanging out. This is time for a change. Well, I overcome the serious injury that I had to go through for the last year and a half. It's about rebuilding. You start getting like this, this tunnel vision. And your senses. Your focus becomes like an arrow, man. your diet and when you restrict all this junk you start zooming in like this to your diet your mind becomes zoomed in and you start thinking tunnel vision your focus becomes like an arrow you gotta want it lion is powerful. He has his roar. And you know when the lion roars, it's getting ready to go and fight. Come on, try it out! Ah, Timo! Come on, come on! Try straight up! My name and, and everything, it was just on the line coming into this Mr. Olympia. So I had to, I had to reach for higher power, man. And but I 
also knew that had to do all that I could possibly think of doing to be uh, in this show in the best condition that I possibly could prepare for and uh, and everything fell in place for me. You want to go through those moments, but those moments are the moments that's going to separate you and give you your, your testimony, who you are. How do you handle those times? The Maryland Muscle Machine, the winningest pro bodybuilder in the history of this sport. Three-time first runner-up at the Olympia, coming off a third place from last year. 245 pounds, getting ready to try to go up there and do it again. My thing is uh, coming back and putting on the show. Mm -hmm. uh, that's, I think the posing round is definitely one of my stronger rounds. That fires me up, man. It just fires me up. You know, I, I look forward to the posing at night, man. That's what it's all about. And uh, I think I'm gonna come out very strong and definitely give it, give it all that's there, you know what I mean? Never let anyone tell you that, that it can't be done. You know, you think outside of the box, and people are going to think that you're crazy. But they're going to think you're crazy until you accomplish it. You find a way, continue to move forward no matter what. You know, you have to always try to search and improve yourself. Winning isn't everything. Sometimes when you when you get defeated, it makes you stronger and makes you want to come back and work harder for it. Second place award will be to Kevin Lebroni. It's all about never quitting and never giving up and continuing to go back and learn things new so that you can be better and continuously to grow. No matter what age you are, we let people know that, you know, as long as you really, really, really believe in yourself, as long as you continue to move forward, only you are in control of your destiny. survive, you know? It taught me how to believe in myself, and I think that no matter where you're at, no matter what you're going through, as long as you never give up, you'll never lose, no matter how long it takes.